Welcome to lesson 159 of A Course in Miracles. I give the miracles I have received. And wow, I give the miracles I have received. And this is, if you're honest with yourself, this is quite a confronting, confronting lesson. Yeah. The reason why this confront this lesson is confronting is because what sort of miracles are we talking about? And and, and I really have to look at my, within myself. Let, let's just put an example. Let's say there's a relationship, there's a conflict, there's a situation in your life that you cannot feel peace. Let's say you are very angry with someone and you're really angry with someone and you constantly think of that someone and you get really, and you're angry, yeah? And that is the, the, the main emotion. That's all you can give. Because within yourself, that is all there is to give. And the lesson says, we cannot give something that we do not have, yeah? No one can give what he has not received. To give a thing requires first, you have it in your own possession. You know, sometimes we, we go, oh my God, I wish I could have peace in this relationship. You know, I'm so angry. I don't feel any love. Um, but that's, that's, that's all there is. If you can't feel any love for that particular person or situation or conflict, is because the love is not there yet. You have not received the miracle of love for you to be able to give it, yeah? So, so the understanding within yourself that, that, that gives you the, the understanding <laughs> that all that you create in your world is just an illusion and that it is a reflection of your own beliefs that everything that we have in our world is for, for it to show us what we hold within. So when you got conflict in a relationship, let's say, or a situation, or even your health or, or work or money, and you can't see it any other way, and there is no peace within you and you cannot feel love, is because you don't have it within at the moment. Not that you want, but not at the moment. And this is a big acknowledgement. And I know that sometimes people blame others. They say, oh, with this person, I feel really loving. With this person, I don't feel very loving. That person triggers my anger or my sadness or my fear, whatever. The reality is that all those people, all those illusions outside yourself they're only showing you what you got inside to give so when you receive the understanding then that is what you give and then we are all blessed in our, our relationships our lives our wealth heals but first we have to receive it yeah, it's like if I'm holding my hands really tight, you know, like that, and, and God comes and or the, divine, the divinity comes and he just puts my hands apart. And then he says, now you can caress, or now you can give love, or now you can receive from this, in this situation, because you were like that. So first I received the freedom of, my hands are very tight. I'm very uncomfortable, but I don't even know why. But it's because my hands are tight. Not because anything else, but my hands are tight. When, yeah, I'm separated, I feel freer, I feel happier, I feel love, I feel free, really. Then I can express or receive. <sighs> amazing lesson, amazing lesson. Uh, just go through it as usual and see 
see what your relationships are showing you about you. See what your so-called so-called conflicts are showing you about you. Can I be at peace with this relationship? Or am I, you know, in anger? Or, you know, can I be at peace with my with my health or am I in fear? You know, all our external world only shows what we hold within our internal world. So enjoy the lesson. Don't be harsh with yourself. Just become aware and make a change. And I'll see you tomorrow for 100, uh, 160.